Yeah, what's up guys? Sean here, aka I'm a flying midget. Welcome back to some theme park tycoon 2. I'm showing off a super legit park today. I know nothing's changed. I'm always showing off awesome parts. Also, man, I really miss that shirt right there. I miss the different colored midget shirts. I might have to start wearing some of those ones. That's one of my favorite other colored shirts right there. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're back in Theme Park Tycoon 2, guys. If you have never seen this park, um, then that's kind of funny because I feel like, what, we ended this one almost like a year ago that I built this park. And I figured I'd load it up today because it said like I was getting, it was like 200 something days since we last loaded this park up. So I figured, you know what, let's reminisce and look at this thing. Um, I also want to say, guys, I started a new series on Water Park World, um, very similar to Theme Park Tycoon 2. If you haven't seen that, then you should definitely go check out that episode when I did it like, what, two days ago now? Um, so we're going to be doing a newer series on that, and it's going to be really cool and awesome. I don't know how many more Theme Park Tycoon videos I'll do. I know there's still tons of parks that everyone wants me to show off. Um, so continue to tweet them at me. If I haven't added you as a friend, um, then uh, then let me know on Twitter because I'm trying to show a lot of these parks before um, this game inevitably kind of you know goes downhill in terms of player counts because most people are going to be going over and playing Water Park World. Um, I know that's what I'm going to be spending most of my time on and uh, hopefully going to be able to show off some really cool water parks soon. Um, so that's kind of the focus, but today I was like, you know what? I got a park that I could show off, so we might as well make a little video of Rooney on it. But now that I look at this park, it's so simple. Yet when I built it, I was like, this is the coolest park I think I've ever made. And it's pretty average. I mean, it's pretty average. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. But I'm excited, like I said, to kind of start building into my um, into my water park world to, uh, to make some really cool parks there and to also show off some really cool parks. So let's show this park off that we're showing today. It's actually by Big Tiger. Um, and, um, and I've actually shown off a park before by Big Tiger. It's actually the really cool ride. Um, so I'm kind of excited to go through this one. I haven't really seen much of it except for the, the front of it, the very kind of beginning of it. So here it is right here. This is uh, Big Tiger is right over here, right there in her Komodo. Um, yeah, so this is like a, uh, this is a, oh, let's see. Is there a name for it? Tropical Park. I think that might be an old name. I'm almost positive that is an old name, but I will still like this park because it is really cool. Look at this thing. Oh, hello. A little bit of lag or something like that. Um, so this is a Japanese coaster kingdom, or this is supposed to be a roller coaster that's all built around like a Japanese theme. So as you can see, really cool. And there's a lot of really cool custom things in this that I want to kind of show you guys. And then I also want to talk about... If we're going to see building techniques like this that we can use in uh, in Water Park World. So it would be kind of an interesting one. Now that we've got Water Park World and it's kind of like a new building game for us, I want to see what things will transfer over from Theme Park Tycoon into Water Park World. Um, but yeah, so all right, so here it is. Really cool. I love the theme of these... Um, of these buildings right here, definitely, you know, very, very Japanese themed and kind of looking really good. Um, I don't really know how these, uh, these rounded things, oh, they're tombstones. Whoa, super smart. Super smart. Those are tombstones. Wow. Okay, cool. So another thing I want to um, kind of talk about is in Theme Park Tycoon 2, if you guys look at all of these kind of building things, really in the scenery, all of these things, now I don't want to say all of them, but majority of these are going to be in Water Park World if they're not already. But if you guys notice, the theme is very, or I shouldn't say the theme, the the um, artisticness of it, the artisticness of it or the way they look is a little bit different. And I kind of like it in Water Park World a little bit more than this. This one's like a little too real. And for Roblox, when you have something that's real, it's kind of like awkward and hard to kind of make it look good. So I feel like that more cartoony look that Water Park World has, um, I think will be really cool. And then also, guys, um, another thing about this is, you know, a lot of the stuff is very rigid in, in this game and very rigid in Water Park World. But remember, like, this game, uh, Dennis has been fine-tuning for like a really long time. So... Um, and, and the building styles change as things are fine-tuned like for example you can see right here Which we'll get up and we'll get up close and personal that is a rounded walkway a rounded pathway And that was something that was relatively new to theme park tycoon um, that we haven't really been able to do since I started theme park tycoon Right, so we were able to do that. I don't know like I want to say six months ago is when we were able to start doing some curved stuff um and so I know a lot of people are thinking about Water Park World right now going, oh, it's very basic, can't really build a whole lot. But that's exactly how this game started out, and now you can build some amazing things like this. So that's what I'm excited for in Water Park World, and I'm excited to kind of go through this park. So, all right, so Japanese Coaster Kingdom, let's go, baby. All right, so this is like a compass. This is kind of cool. Watermark. All right, so I like how the flooring is this path, and 
it's actually all going along with this curved way. So this is a single rail coaster right here, right? Sing single rail coaster to get that um to get that curved look. But I wonder how the path is done. Ooh, dark ride. Whoa. So that's a dark ride on the curve thing matched to the texture to make it look like it's... Oh, yeah, you can totally see that's a dark ride. Totally matched up. Oh, wow, really cool, smart idea. Like, super, super smart idea. I don't know if I've seen that one before. Or have I? I did show off one curve thing before that blew my mind, and I don't remember if it was the same technique, but that's really smart. So that is the dark ride right there, and then it overlaps with the path. Wow. Super cool building unique or technique, really cool. Okay, um, what do we got over here? I'm getting, I'm getting a little sidetrack now. I'm getting a little sidetrack. I also can't fly around because we're not on a VIP server. I do want to check this gnarly thing out over here, and I feel like the only way I'm going to be able to do it is maybe to jump up this ride. Let's jump up this ride. I think that'd be, I think that'd be kind of cool. We're gonna, we're gonna run up this guy because this thing is insane. So we got a waterfall with like some trees, very Japanesey themed. Whoa, whoa, dude, what is this? Like a freaking Desert, temple, god, something like that. Oil barrel, trees. What are those down there? Palm trees. Wow. Really creative way to build that. All right, we're going to... Oh, what? Lame. I can't run in there. All right, we're... Oh, hardcore, parkour. Hardcore, park, freaking core. All right, and more tomb... I love the tombstones, how it kind of gives you that rounded look. Really unique, really cool. I'm really hardcore parkouring it right now. Um, I feel like I'm a boss. Can I not go through that area either? Dang it, glass panel as well. Dang nabbit, boys. Dang nabbit. All right, well, I want to get a front a front view of this, so we're just going to run around this way because um, this is really cool in the front. So I don't know what if, if this is supposed to symbolize something japanese type theme, but I love how this is done. It's a single rail coaster, and it, it it they're mirrored perfectly. Well, I say almost perfectly. They're mirrored really similarly, and it looks like those, like, mantis -y, japanese -y things. So, again, another ridiculously creative way to build that with the coasters, um, and even has it over here as well. And I want to say these are probably two different coasters. Those are probably two different coasters to get them to, to be that close. Um, and again, goes along the building. Like it looks like it's part of the building. So another really cool and unique feature. I mean, come on. Big Tiger is like one of the best builders in Theme Park Tycoon. I will say that. One of the most creative builders. There's some temples down there. It looks kind of cool. Um, so it's always good to see builders like this and then to see kind of what they're able to build and, um, and kind of, you know, not necessarily steal some of their ideas, but to kind of, you know, build off their ideas and kind of make them, make them into some cool things that you can do. What are these? Oh, those just primitive. Okay, yeah, they're just stacked. So I feel like I've seen something similar to that um, before, but... I'm also excited to see all of you amazing builders that are in Theme Park Tycoon 2. I'm excited I'm excited to start seeing all of your creations in Water Park World. And again, guys, if you're sitting there going, Midget, I can't play Water Park World because I don't have Robux for it right now. Um, again, go check episode one. I'm running a giveaway right now to give you guys some Robux so we can get as many people playing that game as possible. All right, so what do we got here? This is classic Japanese. Um, I don't even know what these things are called, but they're just like Japanese buildings. Whoa, what are those? Tires. Wow. Super cool. And then barrels. Yep. Wow. Really cool. Okay. Also, what is that? Oh, that's the, that's the top spin ride. Um, all right. Sweet. I like that. I like that. I love the pink, the pink trees and the pink kind of like flooring to give that Japanese feel. Also, what are these? A tree. How did you do that at the top? Is that like another tree? I'm telling you, man, the, the, the creativity, absolutely insane. All right. Massive ride right there. Loving it absolutely freaking loving it wow and a big green button to send them off to go send mobile all right um i'm not sure if there's gonna eventually be stuff in there i think what well, we need to go on that side of the park i guess we could ride it why don't we ride this ride I'm sorry, i everyone always gets mad at me They're like midget you never ride rides sorry boys it already make it, it makes videos super long but i feel like um we're cruising through this and this ride looks amazing it looks like it took forever to build so let's do it. wow this is like classic classic um ride or classic, like, I guess, theme park, like, where the lines are so long that, like, you're in line majority of the time. I hate that. I hate that. Gotta get that fast pass, you know what I mean? Here we go. All right, use this seat. Let's go. Let's roll. Whoa, wow, that started, like, really quick. Hold on, I want to X out of this. We want to get the full experience. Also, sorry I had to turn the music off. Um, another one of those kind of custom, awesome, really nice and cool um, Japanese music, but... Again, the copyright issues on the YouTube's boys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, this is cool. What's up, bro? 
What's up, bro? You know what would be really cool in Theme Park Tycoon, and maybe it's something that Dennis will add in uh, Water Park World, is if you were, like, sitting here, and then, like, you're... When you, when you look over to your left, like, your character actually moves its head. So, like, if that guy were to look at me right now, like, his head would be, like, turned to the side. How cool would that be? Absolutely unreal. Um, what's that floating in the sky right there? What's good, bro? What's good? All right. Here we go. Send mobile, boys. Send mobile. I love how you can build through structures now because you... Whoa, that is a really fast coaster. Um, because you can just build way cooler things, and I think it's an awesome game pass that... Dennis added in and again I'm excited for all of these things to be making it into water park world this is actually a really cool coaster and I don't even think there's any boosters in here like I don't think that I don't think we, we've had a single booster I think it's literally just from gravity that's super cool and kind of rare okay that might have been a booster right there that was either a booster or a break I don't really know but I definitely saw something on the track um so I don't know but it is kind of hard to make a really fun and awesome see like that was a booster had to have been a booster um, it's, it's hard to make a really fun coaster without boosters because you need like a massive height all the way up to the top. But you know, that was a fun, that was a fun little coaster. Welcome back. Hey, thanks. Thanks, dude. All right. I'm going to cut across here actually while we're over here. Cause I want to get this last part of the park before, before we send this off. But I want to know your guys' feedback on, on what you want me to upload. All right. Cause I know a lot of people are like, midget, I want you to continue, you know, playing theme park tycoon, you know, make another park or or do something like that. So let me know in the comments what you guys want to see. Uh, personally, for me, I don't know if I have the motivation to build a whole nother massive park. Maybe I could kind of revamp one of my other parks that I have and kind of make it better and and um, with some newer stuff. But I don't know if I can create a whole new park, dudes, because it's a big – uh-oh, we're blocked. It's a big time commitment, and um, I kind of want to take all those creativity juices and just throw it into uh, – Throw it into Water Park World instead of instead of Theme Park Tycoon. But, all right, I'm going to hardcore parkour up this. Do not fall, midget. Oh, don't fall. Hoo, this is bad. I'm going to fall. I'm totally going to fall. Oh, there's a ladder right here. I could totally fall. Let's go. <laughs> all right, here we go. Here we go. We made it. Woo. All right, but, yeah, I want to know you guys' feedback. So let me know in the comments. Like, do you guys want to still see me upload Theme Park Tycoon? Do you just want me to show off parks? Um, let me know. Let me know down there because I always like you guys' opinions. Um, what is this ride? Is this new? Steeplechase Coaster. I'm pretty sure that's new. Or maybe it's not new, but it's something that I definitely have not built in any of my parks, which is interesting because that is kind of a trip. I mean, look at that guy. His hands go up and everything. It's like, ready? Woo! Mom, I'm riding a horse! Woo! I didn't even know this was a thing. I wonder when this was added in. Should I, I might actually be relatively recent. Um, and I wonder if Dennis is going to continue to update this game regularly. Oh, well, I thought it just lagged out right there. Um... Yeah, I don't really see – I don't. I, I feel like it's been in the game for a while. And, yeah, right here, been in the game since June 7th. Wow. Shows you how out of the game I've been right there. Wow. Also, is this relatively new? Or oh, – the, the, oh, this is cool. See, this is a custom ride. This is a custom ride that Big Tiger made. I love seeing stuff like this. Just custom stuff. We're going to give it a shot. We're going to give it a shot. Ready? Ready, 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 ready. Let's go. Launch, launch. Oh, my goodness. Launch mobile engaged. I like that. I like that a lot. All right, well, I think that's mainly this park. Hopefully, I got everything. Um, I didn't really go inside these buildings, so maybe I could run inside if there's anything inside these real quick. I think they're just for looks on the outside. But, um, yeah, some some minor decorations and whatnot in here. Um, I love the theme of it. I love I love how creative it is and, um, and how unique a lot of things are. Um, that's the kind of stuff I'm looking for in Water Park World. And also, guys, like I said, if I still haven't shown off your theme park, I am sorry. Tweet at me, let me know. Um, but if I have added you and I just haven't shown it off yet, then you got to message me and remind me because I will totally forget. But that is what I'm going to call the video for today. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy it. If you did, smash that like button. Be on the lookout for some more Water Park World videos and maybe some more Theme Park Tycoon videos, as well as some of that Minecraft stuff that's been going on, on my channel, too. So stay tuned for all that stuff. Hit the bell, hit the notifications, all that kind of good stuff. But until next time, guys, um, I'll see you in the next one. If you haven't already, make sure you be fly and subscribe. Okay. okay, yeah, I'm a flyer. Yeah. Bitch, you're gripping, hit it, spit a killin' with the rhythm, spillin' up the rhythm, chillin' about to make a killin', feelin' always buildin', better stack it to the ceiling, yeah. Uh. Haters over there, we're not aware of ya. Rockin' with my boy Shawnee, a character. Rep the red, white, and blue, America. Uh.